a family member suffer from? Depression, postnatal depression, schizophrenia, bipolar disease, Alzheimer's disease, Parkinson's disease, ADD or ADHD, a behavioural disorder, an autism spectrum disorder or a pyrrole disorder. What is the BioBalance Outreach? Annually in either March or April, our team of internationally acclaimed USA doctors visit Australia to help rebalance you or your family's biochemistry so that you can reclaim your health and vitality. Biochemical testing is done through your BioBalance trained doctor prior to the outreach so we can quickly identify your health concerns and prepare you for your upcoming outreach appointment with our visiting specialists. Your BioBalance trained doctor will attend the consultation with you and learn how to continue your individualised biochemical treatment program for the next 12 months, saving you time, inconvenience and money travelling overseas in order to achieve your best possible outcome. Then there are actually individual patient, if you want to call them, um, interviews where patients come in with their physicians, they are presented by their physicians, and there's a panel of doctors to go over information including laboratory data as well as their clinical history. Um, from that they can actually make nutrient protocols that are most appropriate for biochemical imbalances that are uh, noted. Who are BioBalance? BioBalance Health Association Incorporated is a registered charity and a not-for-profit organisation dedicated to promoting effective techniques of biochemical treatment for mental, behavioural and autistic spectrum disorders. Since 2004, BioBalance has been run by a team of people whose family members have been affected both by mental health and autism spectrum disorders. They have each experienced great success using these protocols and want to share this success with others in similar situations. You won't find a more dedicated team. To achieve these outcomes, BioBalance Health supports the training of Australian and international doctors in advanced nutrient therapies pioneered by the late Dr Carl Pfeiffer in combination with the assessment of patients at the annual outreach clinic on the Gold Coast. This training is led by Dr William Walsh, PhD, of the Walsh Research Institute and his USA faculty, Drs Albert Menser and Judith Bowman from Menser Medical and other renowned leading world-class doctors specialising in the treatment of autism. Dr William J Walsh PhD. Dr. William J. Walsh, PhD, is president of the non-profit Walsh Research Institute. He directs physician and practitioner training programs internationally, including in Australia, England, Ireland, Norway and USA. An internationally recognised expert on biochemical imbalances, he has devoted nearly 40 years to researching the biochemistry behind behaviour, learning and memory, mental health and various other disease conditions. Dr Walsh's approach recognises that nutrient imbalances can alter brain levels of key neurotransmitters, disrupt gene expression of proteins and enzymes and cripple the body's protection against environmental toxins. He has authored more than 200 scientific articles and reports and holds five patents. His early work included a 12-year collaboration with the late Dr Carl Pfeiffer. Dr Walsh has worked with more than 30,000 patients with conditions ranging from autism to schizophrenia to Alzheimer's. Dr Walsh's book Nutrient Power is an essential tool for anyone who would prefer to heal the brain with nutrients rather than drugs. All about Nutrient Power Nutrients have great power, and we recently published a book called Nutrient Power that gives chapter and verse of how this can benefit people. And it's not necessarily an alternative to psychiatric medications, but very often psychiatric medications uh, are not needed if, the, if you can identify 
uh, chemical imbalances or nutrient imbalances in the brain that can, that can often be the cause of these problems. The Biobalance Physician Training Program. Each year the number of Biobalance trained doctors and attending patients has grown in Australia, with 74 doctors and over 160 patients attending the Biobalance Outreach Clinic since March 2016. Over 200 doctors have now been trained by Biobalance. Many doctors enjoy returning year after year to consolidate their skills and learn the latest cutting edge therapies in mental health and autism. We are involved heavily with physician training programs such as the wonderful program that goes on in Australia with the Bio Balance Association. Um, and um, we, we've, the goal of training more than a thousand doctors in the next few years and we're well underway. I think we're already 30 to 40 percent along the way there. Well first I'd like to say that um, here we have the greatest assortment of some of the best minds ever assembled in this endeavor and I'm not including me, I'm referencing Dr. William Walsh and many of the true pioneers that truly care about patients um, literally from all over Australia and they tend to be heads over heels much more facile, much more knowledgeable, much more aware than many doctors around the world. Um, many of the doctors in Australia are really considered to be true leaders in the field, not just here in Australia. And certainly with the additional training from Biobalance, they just move to the next level. You know, after several sessions of coming, uh, every year there's new information to be gained. And uh, the physicians that have been coming over several years have become actually very facile in developing uh, nutrient protocols that are appropriate for their patients. What about autism? Biobalanced visiting physicians in this area include Drs. Megson, Mumper, Buckley and Newbrander and they provide training in advanced autism protocols that have resulted in numerous reports of great improvement or recovery, including effective diets, yeast therapies, methyl B12 treatment, hyperbaric approaches, advanced nutrient therapies, essential fatty acids, collation, antioxidant therapies, example, glutathione on promotion, and many other latest techniques. Can children recover from autism? Um, some people say that there is a, a, a protocol to help children recover from autism. In my experience, it's individu very individually based. The most important thing is that you have um, a clinician who's experienced helping you um, go through the maze of treating children with autism. Many of the treatments that we use are nutrient based, such as B12 and cod liver oil, things like that. Um, but the, the requirements for each child are somewhat different. So like with any medical problem, we try to do our lab analysis and figure out what is needed for each child for their best improvement. Recovery is very possible. I mean, we've always been told that recovery isn't possible. Even the NIH now is thinking that recovery is possible. But I know in my practice, we have a significant number of children who lose their diagnosis officially. Uh, many, many children uh, are mainstreamed and don't even need a shadow. Uh, it's very rare that we don't get somebody who will move, whether it's a little bit or far. You know, so recovery, in the reality of recovery, I'd say at least 20% of children have the potential of recovering. Uh, 60 to 70% of the children have the ability to become mainstreamed. And only about 2% in my practice uh, don't have much benefit from biomedical things. Why do biobalance doctors keep coming back for training? The reason I keep coming back is, is twofold, I guess. One, to keep in touch with um, the experts in the areas in which I deal, um, and to just get that fine tuning that um, I may have missed through just through basic through reading or do other doing other forms of study. I also come because I really believe that this form of um, approach to our children needs to be supported um, and the, to get the word out to everyone. So if I support Biobalance and um, I, could, I, I bring patients to see the visiting doctors, um, it just gives an opportunity for other people to get the value out of um, this sort of medicine.
I come back every year because there's always something to learn and within my practice the biomedical treatments have revolutionised the way that I deal with clients and it has really affected the outcomes of people with depression, people with schizophrenia, people with anxiety and people with bipolar disorder. Uh, we come back for uh, two main reasons. One is to get help from our mentors from the States about the patients that we've found more difficult to manage and also to see how other doctors manage their own patients and pick up uh, new tips as the whole science uh, evolves. Hello, my name is Chris Tester. I'm a compounding pharmacist on the Gold Coast. I've been involved with the Biobalance Group for at least eight years now. Uh, compounding for the Walsh uh, Research in Institute protocols for at least 10 years. So it's um, a very, very exciting time for me and I feel very privileged that I've been able to be involved with these groups. Compliance is essential. Compliance is, is of the utmost importance. You can go to all the trouble to diagnose a problem with the patient. You can spend time with the patient but if the patient isn't able to follow a treatment protocol, then you are guaranteed to have very poor results, if not failure. The doctors invest a lot of time and effort in education, in treating patients for these protocols. They spend a lot of time with the patients, diagnosing the situation and coming up with a solution. So it's essential that the compounding pharmacists play their part and actually guarantee a consistent quality in the product that they supply. The doctor has to be absolutely sure that they're getting exactly what they're asking for. Biobalance success stories. I've seen some amazing success with, uh, with my patients. Obviously every, every child, every adult is an individual. So what works for, for, for one may not necessarily work for the other, but some incredible successes. And that just keeps bringing me back to Biobalance every year. Essentially this is almost the only form of protocol I use with my children now um, and I have, I have success every day. I have um, people that walk through my door and I say hello, how are you, how's your child going and they say really great or they're doing really well or I'm really happy and I genuinely hear that um, on an extremely frequent basis. Occasionally I get the one who's not doing so well, but we, we work around that. I get enormous success and I, uh, I love what I do and I love being able to help these kids that very frequently have been to multiple other, yeah, have tried, have tried multiple other interventions and really are not getting the successes they want. Um, and sometimes I've come to me out of desperation. Um, uh, and I love that because a lot of these kids can turn around and get enormously gratifying change in uh, When we did a follow-up, it's probably easier to quantify the failure rate. Um, we find r roughly one in five people, uh, that's 20%, we make no improvement. Uh, we make uh, some degree of improvement in 80% uh, of our patients and a significant degree of improvement or resolution in about 20% of our patients. Over the years I've witnessed some wonderful, wonderful success stories. Um, I love good news stories and with these protocols um, I'm witnessing so many patients coming to me saying that they're, they're so happy with the outcomes of the treatment and the protocol. I, I, I just find it um, absolutely invigorating. I just can't wait to talk to patients about, uh, about their treatment and their outcomes. It's one of the most exciting and rewarding things I've ever been involved in. He'd been very compliant in taking all his um, tablets and he dropped his pyroles down to normal and they then readjusted his medication and in two months time I suddenly saw the fact that my son was coming back to me and it was a real thrill. Um, at the time he had stopped taking his mainstream medication so we realised that it was only the nutrients that were making the difference. My little boy had epilepsy up to 40 seizures a day and um, we had him on many many different medications, five in total, and they didn't stop the seizures. 
and so that's just our personal pace. Um, but moving forward with the help of an exceptional medical team, um, he's now 20 months seizure free and he's off all of his medications. And really the message that I wanted to just share with you today is that if you've been to see other specialists who tell you that this is it for your child and this is the way your future is now, so you just have to accept that, please just don't give up hope because when you come here you'll be surrounded by not only the most open-minded medical professionals but the most open-hearted as well and together when you have a team like that supporting you you can move mountains so please give it a go if it resonates please come along for more information BioBalance starts taking doctor and patient registrations for the next outreach each September. If you would like to become a BioBalance member and receive information from us, please email Margaret on biobalance at optusnet.com.au or call our general inquiry hotline on 07 5679 6675. For doctor and patient registrations, please call Marnie Lowe on 02 8789 0451 or email Marnie Lowe at tpg.com.au. For general information about our medical doctor training program, outreach patient assessments, patient testimonials, more history on biobalance, latest research, video clips including this one, and the next outreach and public conference, please check out our website on www.biobalance.org.au. Thank you to all our friends for supporting BioBalance, the outreach program and our public conference.